Hey everybody. Hello, I'm Kim. And I'm Erin and we are K and E R V T V. If you are new here, oh, welcome mm -hmm. and happy Easter everybody. Happy Easter. It's Easter weekend and we decided to kind of we still have some um content that we already filmed mm -hmm. that will come out after this, but it's Easter weekend and we've mm -hmm. missed y'all. We know you've missed us. Mm -hmm. So we kinda wanted to bring you along what we're doing for our Easter weekend mm -hmm. so you, we can hang out together. Yeah, our work camping jobs in Central Florida are done. And so we're currently at my dad's house on the west coast of Florida in Punta Gorda and the RV, Lucy, is at the shop right now. She's getting oil changed and getting ready for our future travels. And future adventure where we're going to be <laughs> for the winter. I mean the summer. I keep getting so confused. <laughs> we're just here for the winter. We just spent winter in Florida, but winter in Florida feels like summer. So That's other another video other announcement people. though, so stay tuned. Yes. Hit that subscribe. And yeah, come hang out with us tonight. We're going to dye some Easter eggs. Mm -hmm. We're going to make some fun dinner. Mm -hmm. I don't know how much of that we're going to film because <laughs> it's our first time. We're making Korean corn dogs. Do you know what those are? If you know what those are, leave a comment below. <laughs> Hopefully you'll know by the end of the video what they are because we're going to try to make them. Mm -hmm. But yeah, so we're excited. We miss you guys. So let's do it. All right, come hang out with us. We are Kim and Aaron, and this is Zach and Cody. We are best friends living and traveling full time in our renovated RV, Lucy. We have been on the road since October 2020, so please subscribe to join in on all the fun. RVTV, K and E RVTV, sing it with us. You might have heard these guys in our intro. They're right above us. These are the Purple Martins. My parents have a hotel for them right here in their yard. There's normally a lot more of them. They're scared right now because we came out and they all flew away. But they're so fun to watch and they're so pretty. And they make all sorts of noise. Yeah, so we watch them bringing in like different brush and stuff to make yeah. their nests inside there because this is what they're doing. This is their breeding season. Uh -huh. And But it's just funny because they often can't make it and it ends up right on the dry dock, which you can yeah, see. Yeah, they, they, there's already. plenty of all the twigs sticks and, and twigs and stuff so down there. They can't fit in. But they're so cool to watch. They're so cool. And when the sun hits them, you can really see, especially the male ones, they're like purple coat. Uh -huh. They're so pretty. We've been taking lots of boat rides while we've been here. Coast favorite thing in the world. Yeah, so if you follow us on like Facebook or Instagram, um, there's a, a lot of experience with dolphins that we've had with Cody, yeah. and he loves going on the it's boat. Crazy. He loves hunting for dolphins in the harbor here. Oh, oh. Are Cody, did you find the dolphins? Oh, oh you found God. them right there. Oh, oh my God. Oh, yeah. We both agree that he was a dolphin and if reincarnation is a thing, Cody was a dolphin at some point in his life. Mm -hmm. And he always, when he dreams, he's always so crazy. And we're like, mm -hmm. why is he running? I think we realized oh. he's swimming. Oh, is that dolphin. what it is? Because he moves his legs <laughs> like this. So that's more of a swim than a run, I think. Anyway, it's not important. But yeah, we've enjoyed the boat. Have great weather here in Florida during the winter. It's been awesome. But, you know, we're ready for some different weather. <laughs> so Here's our beautiful Easter tulips. They're looking pretty fun. They've been crazy all going different directions and everything. And, and they close up. In the yeah, they evening. close up at nighttime and then they open back up it's all funny. day. You think they're like dying and they're like all, and then the next morning, hi. That's my workstation over there where I've been working. Yes. Putting we out, trying to put out time. videos for you. We, we haven't been working 40 hours a week, so yes. we have time again. And uh -huh. we are, we are healing emotionally. And we love y'all, <laughs> appreciate you. Right, let's go dye some Easter eggs. <laughs> Hello. Oh, hello. <laughs> that's a Daisy. This is Miss Daisy. She is our sister. That uh, technically that's our sister. Yep. Yeah, and my parents' oh, dog. She's a doodle. Here's old man code. Here's old man codes. Old man codes. He just 14, he just had his 14th birthday yes, along with Aaron. Him. We celebrated Aaron's birthday too. We appreciate all the love you guys leaving comments and yeah. everything. It was it was awesome. felt very special. Yes. Right? Yeah. She loves playing with Cody. Sometimes mm -hmm. um he's not a fan. But he. <laughs> Daisy, you love your Cody. <laughs> he loves it here. And here I am. <laughs> we got two different coloring kits to do our eggs. They both seem interesting. Yeah, we got this neon one. That's so it stickers. comes with like neon tablets, the yeah. stickers that you put after. Glitter. Yes. Glitter. And we got this other unicorn 
color whip. We're Which, gonna like make whipped cream and stuff and then you dye it and you swirl it up. And you add glitter and glue. It's a lot of steps. Yeah. I didn't realize that when I picked out. I picked out that one. Yeah, you picked them both out. Yeah, I did. Yeah, and I just I don't said, get okay. to make all the decisions off. You guys know. If you're, if you're a subscriber and you watch your channel, you know Kim is like, where's the pants? You know, like, whatever. But some, once in a while, I'm like, no, but I really want And she'll be like, all right. So this is, I won. So when she's complaining later, it's my fault. <laughs> She made me, um, she boiled me a bunch of eggs. I did, see, I, I boiled the eggs already. Yeah, where's the eggs? Okay, I will tell you how I made them too, because I know somebody's gonna ask. So, I put them in a pot. You cover them where they're barely, like, just barely covered in water, and then put them on the stove, get them to a boil. Once they're, like, roly boiling, I'm talking, like, <laughs> turn it off. You can leave them on the same burner, depending on your stove, whatever you want to do, but make sure you put the lid on, and then 12 minutes, 12 minutes, you put them in ice bath or cold water. They need to go like cold. It just makes them a little easier to peel. And then we read on these directions, I don't know if it works for all egg dyeing kits, but that they will boil the dye better at room temperature. But you only want to keep them around two hours at room temperature, otherwise you're not gonna be able to eat them. Yeah, we're so gonna eat that these. We're eating these babies. Oh, egg salad is happening. Aaron makes good egg salad. I do, actually. Um, <laughs> but I never dyed, um, brown eggs before. I know, it's, it'll be fun, a little contrast. Those were um, like the oldest ones, so I was like, let's boil them and see what, what they do. Yeah. We're, we're eating them, so. Easter weekend. I got Erin flowers for her birthday. That's what's left of them. There were some beautiful hydrangeas. <laughs> Again, if you follow us on our socials, you would have seen them. Really pretty, but yeah. All right, and my stepmom made the dough for the for Korean, Korean corn, dogs. corn dogs. Okay, so a Korean corn dog is a corn dog. Daisy's playing with her toy right now. Oh yeah, super cute. And no, <laughs> take three. So we're using a coffee mug to start our egg dye. So they're little tablets. This is the neon one. So you mix them with some white vinegar. Yeah. And then you add water. A tablespoon of vinegar. And then, and then a half a cup of water. I don't know if that's going to be enough to cover the eggs. We're going to find out. Doesn't look that, that much. So when I first started mixing the dyes with the vinegar, I was using coffee cups, but they weren't deep enough. So we had these other paper cups and I think they're gonna work out much, much better. Aaron's cooking Cody dinner. Cody <laughs> hungry. He's been barking at us, making noise. Do you want a and tutorial on Cody's dinner? A tutorial? Let us know. Tell me if that looks good to you. Ooh, who wants to eat that? And it smells good to me. Mm, mm, mm. Hi, That's fresh pet. But I'm also going to start oh, making awesome. the whipped powder or whipped cream or whatever we're making. <laughs> we're making dough. We're making dough making to make it. these dyed unicorn eggs. All right, we're about to make some dough for our unicolor whip. All right, so I put the whipped powder in here and then I add one third cup of water, room temperature water. And then I gotta whisk it for 20 minutes. More like three minutes. It says to use the electric mixer, but we're like, we're not baking we weren't here. A, we weren't about that life. We're gonna hand whisk it. So I'm about to hand it over to Erin because you know, I make her do all the work. <laughs> <laughs> I did what I could do and then I handed it over. <laughs> uh, it says until it forms stiff peaks. Can you do that? Peek in. <laughs> Four hours later. Use a hand, I mean, use an electric mixer. Use a mixer. <laughs> All right, so now we're supposed to put this on a piece of parchment paper. We already put down this other tablecloth to protect the table. So Anne's trying to make little piles, little of, the piles of the foam, and then we're going to put the dye in yeah, it. So we can do like a collective. And like a swirl it around. Yeah. Right, we got our little foam piles. Kim just did a couple little drops of blue. You might do this one all three? Yeah. We're getting crazy with it. Woo -hoo. So there's green, blue, and red. Primary colors. Well, I guess green's not primary, is it? I don't know how much I'm supposed to do. Whatever you want. We're gonna Maybe take a toothpick much. and kind of swirl them around. Maybe I should do another blue. <gasps> oh, <laughs> that was dangerous. Be careful. All right, and then you go like this. Yeah, just swirl it around. 
give it a little swirly swirl. Alright, so we figure we're gonna swirl them all up first and then do the dyeing. This one was all three. I did one with just um, blue and green, and then that one's blue and red. And this one's Christmas. <laughs> so I was literally just thinking, I'm like, this is Christmas. And then you just take a toothpick and you swirl it. We're dropping in. I don't know what I'm doing. Mm -hmm. We have no idea, but we're doing it. <laughs> Am I supposed to wipe the foam off right away? Huh? I have no idea. I'm just gonna let it sit in it. Oh, it says to use a dipping and swirling motion to cover each side of the egg. Do not roll. Oh. 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 Place foam covered egg onto parchment paper to color for five minutes. Can I leave it for five minutes? Yeah. So. And then we realized too, once you touch one with the colors, the color's on your gloves, so you're gonna transfer over. So maybe you have a few pair of gloves. And then we gotta let it, let it wait five minutes, and then we're gonna wipe the foam off and yes. see the results. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> Not my favorite transfer dyeing user. Again, I did choose this kit, and I didn't realize how you know it was. What I just thought of. A messy. I just worked in activities at our last campground, and for Mardi Gras, we dyed Mardi Gras masks. But we used shaving cream, and then put the dye in the shaving cream, and swirled it all around, and dyed the masks that way. Basically just like that. But I wiped the shaving cream off right away. We're letting the shaving cream sit on there for five, five minutes. minutes. Yeah. And we'll see. But I think shaving cream with a little food dye probably would have been Yeah, the so thing. these, we, <laughs> are we gonna eat these? Can you eat these? Is this edible dye? Okay, so they turned out kind of pretty. Better than we thought. Except for the brown ones. The brown ones. ones did not do well with the marble, like, you know, no. the foam. But these came out much better than we anticipated. Yeah, and we threw away the rest of the foam. We could yeah. have made more. But we also have, this This kit came with glue and glitter. So I think we can dress, oh. we can dress up these. Oh. These. Sorry, the memory card just died. But this is the glitter we're going to try to maybe glitter some up with. Yeah. Comes this glue, you rub the glue all around, roll it in the glitter, and then you got a sparkly egg. Sparkly so I think egg. We're, we're gonna redeem ourselves with these eggs. Yes. And my stepmom doesn't want to be on camera. Mama so. Bear's been working hard <laughs> here on these Korean hot dogs. So we got some skewers with dog and mozzarella cheese. We have different breading here. That's, and then you deep fry them. This is Cool Ranch Doritos, and that's panko breadcrumbs. We also have some potatoes too. So you dip it in the batter and, then you, roll, and then you roll it in whatever mm -hmm. topping you want. And the whole idea is the cornmeal batter sits for a little bit so it thickens up and gets fluffy. So that's kind of like the trick. And then once you have the batter on it, you roll it in this for that little extra crispy corn. We're excited. We've never tried I would eat one ever. with just cheese. Cause Aaron, that's what these are. Just cheese. Big <laughs> drug soup. <laughs> You went straight for purple. Wonder why. <laughs> Ever color neon? Let's see what it looks like. All right, let's go. And it I'm says gonna... at least five minutes. It I'm says the bit. longer, the brighter the color will be. Hey Siri. So at least five, but longer is probably Set better. Set a five minute timer. Ten minutes starting now. I said five. <laughs> <laughs> so can I just use my fingers? Sure. Don't break the egg though. Then you get dye on Bloop. your fingers. Oh, we're ready to check out an egg. My purple egg. Her first looks egg she so dropped. So good. <gasps> wow. Isn't that color amazing? That's gorgeous. Wow. Get some juice in. Gorgeous. Yes. I love that. Oh, baby, baby. Very pretty. All right, okay. which color you want to see next? Let's. I don't remember what order we did them in, so let's. Ooh. Here we go. It's like a pretty pink. So these are the neon ones, so that's why they're really bright. That's a pretty pink. Yeah, I really like that. Yeah. And again, this box did say the longer you let them sit, the brighter the colors will yeah. get. So what do you think it's been about 10 minutes? Maybe. All right, this is blue. <gasps> Ooh, wow. That's pretty. Yeah. Okay, I definitely like this one better than I, the other one. Yeah, I'm excited. And it's fun. There's a lot of little stickers, and there's even, like, wraps you can boil them in and gives a little more stuff. All right. Let's do green. Green? Yeah. <gasps> yeah. Yeah, you want to keep it in? That's good. 
That's a pretty green. Right. Oh, I'm so happy. Yeah, these are these are popping. Alright. And we can coat these in glitter too if we yeah. want. <gasps> oh, that's ten minutes! Alright, this right, is the yellow. yellow one. Oh, that's pretty too. That is a really pretty yellow. Yeah, so this is ten minutes. Wow. So definitely leave them in there for a minute. Ooh, yeah. if we ever do this. <laughs> All right. Yeah, those are pretty. Last but not least is orange. And Ooh. Okay. Leave it in. Leave it Let's in. Let's see what happens. It's still kind of pale. Okay. Yeah, I think that might have been, been the last one I Look dropped. Look at these. I love but them. These are so pretty. Yeah. I think they came out. Oh, great. Let's get uh, Mama Bear found. Oh, around. Mama Bear found this white eyeliner pencil or something. I don't. This is. I don't even know what this is. So we wrote on some eggs. Okay. So we're gonna drop those. Now. We're gonna see what they do. They might work, may not. Should I do half and half? We're doing it for science. All right. We're experimenting over here. <laughs> we're dipping the batter in the long cup. And then we're dipping it in panko or Doritos. And we're frying it. Ooh, baby. How cute are my eggs coming out? Love them. Got more in here. We made a Kimmy one. I made a Kim one. We got one here for Daisy. That's my parents' dog. I think there's a Cody one. There's a Cody one. <laughs> How you doing, ma'am? It's it's trail and error over here. <laughs> <laughs> we have a pile of cheese and hot dogs and whatnot. So this is not a how-to tutorial. <laughs> it's all it's all. Deep fried and some kind of carbohydrate filled with some kind of cheese. I'm pretty sure we're gonna. It's gonna be good. It. Yeah. <laughs> Look at all this yummy goodness. Okay. So we had leftover batter and cheese. So Aaron's dipping the cheese in the the regular corn dog batter and just doing cheese. This is what it looked like. With okay. yummy cheesy goodness, and I'm like, uh, yeah, that looks amazing. How could you go wrong? How could you go wrong? It's cheese. I'm having blood work on Monday. I have my cholesterol. Oh, okay. high, high cholesterol. I don't want to know. It's, a, it's, a, it's a holiday. It's Easter. Nothing counts on the holidays. Nothing counts on the holidays. <laughs> <laughs> it's Korean corn dog time, baby. Korean corn dog on Easter. <laughs> I'm pretty sure this one is coated in Cool Ranch Doritos. And there's a hot dog and cheese in there. I don't know which one comes first. Cheese. Cheese? <laughs> it's cheese coated in crunchy yumminess. Yeah? Mm-hmm. So I tried the corn dog and it's really good. We just use like the Jiffy uh, corn muffin mix little packages that are like 60 cents. That's one thing that hasn't gone up. <laughs> it was probably 32 cents. And it's really good. But what did you think of your Korean corn dog? Mm. It's good. It's really crunchy. Yeah, I like that part. Mm -hmm. It's it's like crunch, got a good fluff. Mm -hmm. Good texture. But we made these first, so these aren't as fresh as those ones were. Good stuff though. We're really good. I haven't got to the cheese part yet. But this is the cheese that's in the regular corn dog. All by itself Better. in the corn, the cornmeal mix. <gasps> yeah, baby. <laughs> it's like a giant you cheese curd. Cheese bowl? <laughs> <laughs> wow, should I dip it in ketchup? Whatever you want. I don't know. The sweet like chili my, sauce like would be good. I like my corn dog in ketchup. Delicious. <laughs> right. Why cheese. is this a thing? Fried cheese. Fried cheese and cornmeal. Corn dog batter. Mm -hmm. Win. All right, I'm gonna tear in the rest of my plate. See you in a bit. Final thoughts on the corn dogs. Not worth the effort. Not worth the effort. <laughs> nope. Well, in my opinion, the Korean ones were not worth the effort. Mm -hmm. The regular corn dog and the corn dog with the cheese in the middle. So good. I really like those. But the Korean corn The dog Korean dog. one was not worth it. It just made, I think the matter just made them so big and then the, the panko made it so crispy and then. Overwhelming a bit. Yeah, it was just like too much. Mm -hmm. So, but the regular corn dogs were fun mm -hmm. and I like those. And so. then a little, we made some little leftover cheese in the cornmeal. Yeah. Curd things. Yeah, those were so good. Those were like my favorite. <laughs> yeah. 
fried like cheese. This, the mozzarella with the sweet corn meal was like uh -huh. really. I figured with a little bit of honey, it would be like. Mm -hmm. money. Could that. Cody, what'd you think? He's like, give me some. What'd please. you think? I gave him a little bit of my hot dog. He got some batter for me too. Batter? <laughs> mm. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. <sighs> we need an after dinner drink. We need an after dinner mm. nap. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Aaron, are you ready for surgery? Yes, we're going to add some glitter to our eggs now. So you have some glue here. I'm going to cut the tip off. I love how our eggs came out. All right, so mine, I have to add glitter to it. Okay, so. yeah, Aaron loves glitter. We got pedicures the other day. Aaron got purple glitter on her toes. Oh, we're experimenting. Yeah, we don't, I don't know how this, this is going to go. This is just an experiment. We're going to see. Ooh. And then you're going to just... Pour the glitter on? Yep. But look how fun these came out. I really like them. These are the hard hey, ones. Can you, I didn't cut the glitter open. Okay, I'll cut the glitter. <laughs> so Erin's rubbing it in glue, and then I'm the glitterer. She's a sprinkler. Yeah. It's actually pretty fun. Yeah. My dad's pretty. like, are we gonna have glitter in our egg salad? <laughs> Probably. <laughs> Oh, you can do a little, a little heart for smack, right? I'm gonna try. Okay. Do it. Now, get it off. Did it work? I think so. Yay! Still gonna have a little bit of everywhere else because my hands you are had to make, glitter. You had to make Zach his my, egg my, still. Of course. He's always here with us. Yeah. Here are the finished products of our eggs. You're so cute. I yeah. love this one. We did this one with stickers. Okay, you need our BTB. Neon stickers. I love them all. The colors are just so like popping mm -hmm. and vibrant. Mm -hmm. We did one for all of us. And mom and dad, the dogs. We did some fun glitter ones. Mm -hmm. I love this one. They're so fun. This one is like yeah. so pretty. They, it was fun. I actually liked both of them. Yeah. The whipping of the... Mm -hmm. Tie dye ones. Use it. Use the electric. <laughs> <laughs> right. That's the only. And this thing. one we just covered in stickers. And just Aaron, how did we do this one? I Tell don't the know. people how we did this one. Did we they, stole them off. Do of they look familiar? Mama Bear's decorations <laughs> to fill our egg tray, but they fit right in. They we did it for the picture. <laughs> the oh, behind the scenes. Kimberly. I think it's cocktail hour. It's that time. Yep. So I saw a fun shot online today, and it's a Samoa shot, the Girl Scout cookies with the coconut and the caramel mm -hmm. and the chocolate. So we got caramel vodka, we got chocolate Baileys, and we have this coconut cream liqueur. So what do you think? I think you're going to make us some dessert shots. Dessert shots? Yeah, baby. Kim has become quite the, um, I am the actual bartender, but Kim's become quite the martini and dessert drink maker. So we're gonna let well, you do your thing. My parents have a liquor cabinet. Mm -hmm. With a lot of fun stuff. Have one of those. No, so Kim has gotten creative and she's, she made a thin mint martini last night that was delicious. Oh, that's what, you have all these by you? They have some really good like cream liqueurs and this chocolate mint one's pretty good. Um, did you tell them about your birthday cake? Oh, Kim did make me pudding, banana pudding, but added banana cream sipping moonshine. Mm -hmm. so the, pudding. Pudding, the pudding always calls for two cups of milk. So I did one cup of milk and one cup of the banana cream moonshine. And it was yeah. so and good. the banana pudding that way, with layered with the vanilla wafers. So good. Bananas. It was absolutely delicious. So and good. we're gonna make it again probably. We'll make it for you because it was so good. My pie minus the moonshine. Yeah, just so we can, you know. Luckily we were able to find it at a liquor store. Yeah. We before. saw a few recipes and we just kinda like we're like, let's go for it. What do we have? We found Sugarlands, right? Yeah. Sugarlands banana cream. Very good. Alright, I need a cup of ice. Okay. Oh, oh. oh. Caramel. So you want me to just do one of each? Go. Yeah. We'll just do equal parts. Equal parts, shake it up on some ice and we'll sip it down. I'll probably make a couple. Mm -hmm. This chocolate Baileys, so good. And the bottle's pretty the too. The espresso Baileys is also really good. Baileys is just really good. I was making some, <laughs> I was making some uh, espresso martinis. They were so good. And I'm telling you, the Thin Mint one you made yesterday was so, so good. It literally that I like made with mint. vanilla vodka. It was so delicious. Yum. Ooh. 
Mess maker, mess maker. <laughs> Alright, baby, let's shake it. Shake it. Woo! <laughs> Samoa shot. I hope this is good. It looks good. Alright, let's do it. Happy Easter, everybody. Happy Easter. I hope everyone's having a great day with family and friends. That's so good. It literally tastes like a smell. Wow. That is so dangerous. That's <laughs> dangerous. Cheers. Um, I, you threw yours another. back. I'm savoring mine. There's more in the jar. Mm -hmm. Kim made my dream come true. She turned this shot into a martini with a little chocolate. A martini is just like three shots in one. It's really it's basically the same thing. It's in larger form. It literally tastes like a smell. It's crazy. It's so good. Yeah, so it's caramel vodka, chocolate Baileys, and like a coconut cream liqueur. You could probably use cream to cocoa if you can't find the yeah. <coughs> liqueur. It'll give you the same flavor. And I put a little chocolate on the rim. It's perfect. Cheers. And I uh, may or may not have made one for myself, y'all. I'm on vacation. <laughs> Happy Easter. All right, before we end this video, we just kind of want to give you a little... I don't know what the word is, but I'm kind of like what our video order is going to be after this. Sure. So we did do a airboat ride while we were in mm -hmm. Central Florida. So that will be the next video after this one. So fun. Um, we also went to Disney. Yeah, we showed that at the end of our last video. Yeah, so we'll, um, we took you along with us for that. We had so mm -hmm. much fun. Finally there after how long. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, so um, we're going to make another video to kind of announce where we're headed for the summer. Mm -hmm. So make sure you stay tuned for that. And again, if um, you've been with us, we appreciate you. We've missed you. We're happy to be on more regular basis. We're we'll getting see. there. We'll see. <laughs> we're getting. We're trying anyway. Um, but if you are new to our channel, again, welcome and thank you for hanging out with us. And we do fun things. Yeah, those we love Easter you to join eggs. us. I love those Easter eggs we did today. Oh, they came out so good. Like we were really like in the beginning, we we're kind of like we didn't see the vision. Mm -hmm. We had the vision, but we didn't see it. But they actually turned out so cute, mm -hmm. kind of eclectic. I like that they're a little. They're all a little different, mm -hmm. so but it was really fun. And mm -hmm. we haven't done um, dyed Easter eggs in yes. a minute, so that was really fun. In a minute. But we hope you all enjoyed your holiday and um, spending time with family or whatever you're doing. I'm sure a lot of you were working, so mm -hmm. cheers to you. Cheers to us. We love you guys, and we'll see you in the next episode. Happy Easter, y'all.